Hello dudes, it's me Alanis10 here, back with another Windcraft quest guide. Today we are taking a look at Wind Excavation Site B. It's a combat level minimum of 46, it's a medium length quest. Bring the yellow crystal shard to Excavator Lycron at those coordinates. We're gonna start off by right clicking to track it. Now we have to have completed Wind Excavation Site A, level 35, to do this quest. And once you've completed it, you get a yellow crystal shard, which you will need to start the quest. So we're starting in Nesak and we're gonna make our way south. We're basically gonna follow the path all the way south until we get to the uh, excavator. So we're gonna go all the way over here and at this intersection we're gonna go to the left and continue southward. And over here we continue to the south and we can see the excavation site right here. It is this hole in the ground with the tents around it. So we enter the hole here we are, and Lycron is right over here by the crates. Good day! You're the person that helps uh, helped us out in the desert, aren't you? Excellent! Just have the person, just the person I need. Can you help me out with the problem I have? Perfect. You see, we are uh, supposed to be searching for some uh, long lost ruins of ancient wind, just like in the desert. However, it seems no progress have been made recently. My workers have stopped working. The problem is there's the strange there are strange creatures at the bottom of the cave disturbing them. I need you to go and kill them. But first you should go talk to one of my colleagues. He has more information for you. He's located directly at the bottom of this cave. Go sp uh, speak with him. Uh, go on now, off you go. Ship click to start the quest and we're gonna continue down here and all we do is basically just go to the bottom you can go down in the spiral cave or you can just drop down into the water much faster and then once we're down here we can dodge these mobs here and here he is flendar and we know what you stole from us in the desert take this you won't be escaping this dead end anytime soon and he kicks us down into this large hole and what we do is that we just continue through the cave here and then dodge all the mobs ignore them to the best of our ability and we reach this puzzle and this is what we need to create make a shape that fits all three perspectives get rid of that minor dude and this is what we need to do so, how we do this is that this glass is going to show sort of where we place things. So, we're going to start off by uh, going forwards. And then we're going to place one block. And then we're going to go uh, back and then to the left and place one. And then we're going to go right. We only have a certain amount. Um, just so you know. So, we're going to place one there. And then we're going to go up, place up place up place until we get here and then we're gonna go forward and left so we sort of have it diagonal here and we're gonna place it and then we're gonna do the same we're gonna go forward and left so we get another diagonal and place it and we're gonna do that one more time we're gonna go forward and left and place it for the last diagonal here and then we're gonna go down place down place down place as you can see and then we go to the right and we sort of mirror what we did here so we place that there and then we go to the left and then back and we place it so you get this structure oh yeah basically it's like that and then like that up diagonal and then down and then it opens over here and we can continue through so for this cave we're just gonna run through it basically Here we are. So we're gonna run through this cave. The very end here, go past all these big machines. And we're gonna continue.
and here we can see the, this uh, big door here we don't need to talk to this guy we just need to walk past him and enter this hole in the stone right next to the door We're gonna have this little cave that we walk through and leads us to the back of the door where we can see this large crystal we grab one shard and we head through the teleport there we are and now we're dropped into this black room we press the button and exit and we're gonna exit right behind excavator uh, uh, like rock let's talk to him I have to admit I'm impressed I genuinely thought our plan would be successful who knew that uh, that dead end had a secret exit not me apparently we know what you took in the desert you were just some kid expected to do, de do a delivery job who knew you'd take a shard of the crystal don't pretend like you don't know uh, what it is you know as well as I do combining the four crystal shards told to bring unlimited power it will not interfere any longer the location of the remaining crystals are known only to us the fire and leaf crystals are safe I see that tricking you isn't the way to defeating you if we ever meet again I'll uh, we'll be using force and upping our security now I never want to see you again our society uh, our company I mean will not to tolerate your interference again and there we go quest completed win excavation site B 50,000 experience points 1536 emeralds and one purple crystal shard that you will need for wind excavation site c anyways that was it for this quest guide thank you guys for watching i'll see you in the next one goodbye